were sponsored. They besieged the Secretariat, raided the Secretariat, destroyed properties, attacked journalists and ourselves. And they left a journalist in the name of Lawal Muhammad in the pool of his blood. Now that cannot be the compass of this party. We're here to call on the national leadership to set up an investigation panel to bring the perpetrators of those to book. And sadly and unfortunately, thugs were acting in Kahoot with the police in Kahoot. A DPO, divisional police officer, led the thugs into the Nigerian Union of Journalists Secretariat, where people were injured. Now we should go back to history and see. If we continue on this path, where one person feels he's a god and everyone should bow down before him, I think we are simply repeating the very problem that destroyed the party we ejected out of power. Gentlemen of the press, if this country has to change, if our party has to provide that vehicle for change, then there should be change in the way and manner we do our politics. People who resort to the use of violence or thugs to annihilate or liquidate passive political opponents are on the wrong side of history. We are not agents of violence. We are party, loyal party men and women. And we are saying very clear to all Nigerians and to this party that if this party will have to win the 2019 elections, it most, apart from being able to fulfill its campaign promises, but set an example for discipline, for comradeship, chose the way. But what is happening behind is something we will not tolerate. We appeal to the people in the position of power to know it very well. And that very God that brought the APC to power is still alive. And he will always listen to the cries of people who are oppressed, people who are denied, and people who are marginalized. We're here in the spirit of that and hope to get the cooperation of the national leadership to come to the rescue of the party in Kaduna before it is too late. I thank you very much. By the cross-section of this leadership you have seen here in Kaduna to address the press at the Kaduna State Press Center was meted with one huge extreme violence that left so many people in a pool of blood. This is the second reason why a cross-section of the leadership of the APC found it very, very necessary to visit the National Working Committee and ask that a special intervention through a special committee must be set to curb the occurrence and reoccurrence of such happening that should never, ever be seen within the fold of the APC. We have written petitions to the National Working Committee with cuttings of such newspapers this morning that has been awash for the degree of violence that has been sponsored by the same cohorts who tailored that kangaroo sitting to produce what was a list of their own nominees to pass as elected delegates for Kaduna State. We have seen the 
the cross section of the National Working Committee headed by the chairman. They have accepted the petitions. They are going to sit on them. But we have made it very, very clear that APC in Kaduna State is undergoing very serious hemorrhage. 